At Stanford, I'm working on finding a, a cure for hearing loss by pursuing, uh, by, by figuring out how stem cells are able to turn into inner ear cell types, like inner ear hair cells and inner ear supporting cells. And we are doing this research right now on mice, and we are in the process of extending this to humans and hopefully also uh, toward human patients. For the hearing restoration project, um, the work that we are doing um, will be key because it will provide a link to the human patient. Uh, once we are able to isolate cells from human patients and turn them into inner ear cells in a culture dish, we will be able to uh, uh, work on therapies uh, in a culture dish before we actually translate these therapies into the patient. And the work that we are doing provides the, um, the basis for this. I think it's realistic uh, to think that we are going to be in the clinic in 10 years with some forms of cures. I don't think we will find a general cure for hearing loss that cures everybody. But I think there will be hope for certain groups of patients. Um, and we will be able to uh, hopefully within 10 years have treatments that are non-device based in the clinic. The hearing restoration project is really well positioned right now because it uh, kicks in where the NIH uh, leaves, leaves off. It provides ample seed money and initiative for a collaborative a group of researchers to pursue projects that otherwise wouldn't be fundable.